What's up, party people? Welcome back to my channel. Today we went to Vulcan Valley Apple Farm. I've said it wrong like 18 times, so I had to write it down. <laughs> it's in the Southern California, a little bit past like Temecula. Actually, it's a lot past Temecula, let's be honest. It was an extremely long drive. <laughs> I'll also be sharing with you guys my apple pie recipe that I will, that I, that I'm going to make out of the apples that we got today. So Stay tuned and enjoy the episode. Are we ready to go apple picking, guys? Woo! -hoo! Yeah. <laughs> Pretty. Mess up. Woo, we're here. It's called the redder, the redder, the better. Uh huh. It rhymes. And what else did the lady say? Or did you not hear what she said? Cause well, I some of it, like the redder the better thing. Cool. It's so pretty here. Yeah. Adam, are you gonna help mommy? Yeah. I, I'm actually, I'm actually, I'm actually, I'm actually surprised I'm saying this, but this place looks a lot better than the yeah. last place we went to. Yeah, it does. Yeah, yeah. Um, no. <laughs> <laughs> okay, the I have to ask ends Daddy. Of each row are gala. Those are the ones you want to eat, and then we can go down all the ones aisles that are open. Okay. So these are oh, all closed. Oh, these are all closed. Okay, so we gotta go find an open aisle. Let's go, guys. Adam, come get one off the tree. You're so cool. Come pick one. Yeah. So I gotta find a red one. Come on. Oh, and also the bigger, the better, I bet. Come on, let's pick one. No, 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 Come on. Oh, nice. Get it. No, no, no. My bag's pretty cool. Oh, okay. So I'll give it to you. Oh, you can give it to me. My bag's not that full. You are helping me. Good job. Awesome. Adam, are you okay? You don't want to help? Here, put it in the bag. Please. Come on. You want to help? You're ruining your dress, sweetheart. Come on. You can help. What is your take on it, Andy? Yeah, have a bite of Andy's. You want to try it? Is, is that tart? That's pretty good. Is it? <laughs> Joe, you gotta tell me your opinion. Right off the branch. <laughs> Autumn, you wanna eat? Uh, you wanna try it? What's your vote, Joe? Uh, it's okay. <laughs> Not that great? At least try. Your brothers are already filled their bags. You don't like it? Stop. Come on, sweetheart. We gotta keep walking. No, 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 Please. Come on. No, 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 no. You're not feeling it? Come on. No, no, no. Come on. No, 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 no. Tart? Okay. Mm -hmm. Adam doesn't really want to participate this year. She's like over it. Is it too hot, sweetheart? Is that why you don't want to do it? This one's super sweet. I'm on video duty. <laughs> duty. Oh, is it tart? Let me Maybe. see. Maybe. Uh, give it, give it a whirl. All right, what do you taste? Sweet. Sweet. I want you to try, please. She doesn't want to do it. There she goes. Do it. Good job. See? I vibe. I'm proud of you. See? You did a good job. Thank you. What do you think of the cider, Joe? You should definitely try it. Yeah. It's so good. You want some cider, Adam? No. It's delicious. Hey, that's pretty good. <laughs> Look at all of our loot. I think it's good. It's very refreshing. Mm, Adam, you want to try it? Let's not touch the fence. You want to try it? Yeah, you guys want water? Adam, can we get off the fence, please? You want to go, Adam? You want to go bye-bye? Adam, are you ready to go home? You over that? <laughs>
Good singing, baby. <laughs> she loves this song. <laughs> today but I'm not going to be using all of them only the ones that are super tart so the green ones so the first thing I'm gonna do is clean them I think the rest would be called for nine but I might need to use a lot more than that because they're so small they're so small okay so the first thing I did was pick out all the tart apples and Tom tasted one of them to make sure these are the ones that are the tart ones I only need, how many do I need for the recipe? Eight apples, like medium size. So I might, since some of them are so tiny, I might just pick out the big ones and that's it. So we have to set the oven at 425. And then I will start making the filling. All right guys, so first thing is clean the apple. I cleaned all these and I already started, but I want to show you. I don't know if I'm doing it right. Like I told you guys, I am not like any professional baker or cook or any of that bullshit. So what I do is I just peel the apple all the way around, get the skin off. Hmm, this one looks kind of weird underneath. I don't know about this apple. We'll see once we cut it open. Okay, and I get the top part and the bottom part. All right, so all that's peeled off. That can go in the trash. What I do next is I cut it in half. And I take out the core, whatever you call it, thingy jig. You know this tool that's on the top of your thing? That's how I take out the core. I don't know if you knew you could do that, but you can do that. So the core is out. I don't know if all um, peelers have that on the top, that little thing where you can screw it out, but mine does. Then you just cut it into small pieces. I just learned this on YouTube from watching somebody else. I don't even know <laughs> if I'm doing it right, but I didn't learn from anybody. I learned from watching videos on YouTube. <laughs> I'm like, okay, let's Google it and see how you do it. <laughs> and that's how you do it. Throw it in there. I also throw a little bit of lemon juice in there so it doesn't turn brown. That's it. So I'm going to do that for all of these. Okay, so I always tell you guys I like to make things easy for myself. So I just buy the pre-made Pillsbury pie crust. Super duper easy. I don't have to worry about making that crap on the sides. I'm not doing all that. Who's got time for that? Not me. All right guys, so now we're gonna make the filling, which calls for one stick of butter. So this is not healthy by any means. So just so you guys know, this is the real deal. Real apple pie, not diet not healthy first you do you heat up the butter so you got to melt it down and whisk it okay so now we have melted down the butter we're going to add three tablespoons which i already have set aside of flour and we're going to whisk it in i'm going to lower the heat a little bit and then we're going to add the white sugar and we have half a cup of white sugar that I already have to the side. We're gonna whisk that in. And then lastly we're going to add in half a cup of brown sugar which I also already have to the side. I really recommend you set it to the side and have it ready because once you turn the heat on it's gonna be hard. Okay, and then after that, you add the water, which is a fourth a cup of water. Okay, so a fourth a cup of water, and then there you go. Whisk it up. Some of the brown sugar does not look so good in here. <laughs> because, is this brown sugar old? Because I don't know why it looks like that. <laughs> 
Okay, so then it says to bring it to a simmer for five minutes. Alexa, set timer five minutes. So I'm going to, I will set that timer, let it simmer a bit. Okay, so I took them out of the packaging and I put the apples already in there. And I'm going to take the filling that I just made and I'm gonna pour it onto the apple. Make sure it's even. Let me get a spatula. Now make sure you use all of it. Okay, so now I'm gonna make the top part out of the other. Okay, since I don't wanna buy another pie crust, I'm just gonna use this pie crust to put on the top, but I'm just gonna cut off the edge. And I might reuse the edge for something else. I might not. This is what I do. Everyone's probably looking at me like I'm from crazy town, but this is what I do. <laughs> okay, so this will be something we'll use for later. So I'm gonna take this, flatten it out, take it out of the pan, and make sure you put flour on here. Wow, your flour power is no flour. Hey, I'm making a video. <laughs> then I take um, my star cutter and I just start cutting stars randomly. And I'm gonna use the stars for later, so I put them to the side. I, I've done hearts before, this is the first time I've done stars. You guys will, you guys will see what I do at the end. Okay, so this pretty much just looks like a star nightmare. We're gonna put an egg wash on it. Okay, so here's my star nightmare. It didn't turn out great, but it is what it is. So next we're gonna take the egg and we're going to put it on all of the parts of the crust before we stick it in the oven. They call it egg washing. We're gonna wash the egg. <laughs> you get the idea. Okay, so it says to bake it for 15 minutes. Alexa, set timer 15 minutes. And then 15 after 15 minutes, reduce the heat to 350 and then cook it for 45 minutes. There is my pie. Doesn't it look beautiful? So the drive there was so freaking long. I don't do good on drives. Like I'm like, my legs start hurting, my back hurts, my kids start complaining and I'm like, Um, it was really windy road and I guess I just wasn't thinking it was going to be that long of a drive. So I had an idea in my head of what I thought it was going to be. And then it wasn't anything like that. So then we get there and as you guys see in the video, Autumn is not having it. She wants nothing to do with it. I finally convinced her to do at least one apple, pull it off the tree, but that was like literally pulling teeth and she was whining the entire time. So we couldn't even really walk around. Plus it was so sweltering hot. And there was like nothing we could buy because everything you had of cash, which we didn't know because the previous place you could use credit cards. So we were like not prepared. <sighs> you know, you have an idea in your head of how you want things to go and then it goes totally wrong. Doesn't it happen to all families? <laughs> and it's frustrating. I think the most annoying thing too is there's nothing really around there. Like you have to drive miles to get anywhere else. So we had to go to the bathroom. All they had was porta potties. I was like, freaking shoot me. <laughs> And like at Riley's Farms, because that's where we usually go every year, they have other activities. They have other things to do besides just pick apples. So like you can distract the kids with other things. Yeah, I really don't recommend that place. <laughs> if I'm being 100% honest, hard pass. I feel bad because it was my husband's idea to try something new. And I, I'm really stuck on Riley's Farms and that's where we always go because it's not as far. And like I said, there's other things to do there besides just pick apples. And... I'm like, okay, we'll just, we'll try something new. Let's, let's test it out. And then the drive, I was like, this place better be worth it. Like literally 
windy roads. Joe gets car sick, so that's another thing. Luckily, he didn't get car sick. He was fine, but I was worried the entire time when we're on our way there, having like anxiety, like, oh my God, somebody's gonna get sick in the car. This is freaking annoying. How far away is this motherfucking place? <laughs> like the whole way, the whole way there. I couldn't wait to just freaking get there. Then we get there and I'm like, this is all it is. Are you freaking kidding me? <sighs> anyway, we made the best of it. <laughs> And then I came home and made pie, which who doesn't love pie? <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you hit that like button. Also, if you haven't already, subscribe. And you can also follow me on Instagram at FitMomod. Hope you guys have a great day.